The story of modernization is essentially a Western story. It starts with the British Industrial Revolution in the first half of the 19th century. By as late as 1945, modernization and modernity were an exclusively Western story apart from Japan. Every country was Western. And what's more, the West and Japan use modernization against the rest of the world, essentially. They colonize it, including China. And in colonizing it, they deliberately held back its development. They prevented modernization. So essentially, those societies were caught in a situation of paralysis and stasis. That was a fundamental characteristic of Western modernization. And Chinese modernization? Well, it is extraordinarily different from the Western mentality. Chinese modernization is, sees its role, sees its place in the world alongside other developing countries to give the opportunity for developing countries to begin the process or advance along the process of modernization. So essentially, Chinese modernization you can think of as a public good for the developing world. <laughs>